In this short video, we're going to show you how to change your units in the RAM modeler. Now, if I move my cursor on the screen, what I'm going to notice is that in the bottom right hand corner of the status bar, the coordinates for wherever, for wherever my cursor is located will be indicated. Now, when I created this RAM structural system model, I told the program I wanted to work within the English unit system. And by default, it's going to have me modeling using feet. There may be times that it might be easier to enter something into the program using inches rather than feet. For example, I want to move this beam eight inches over to the left. Well, eight inches doesn't round very nicely into feet, so I'd rather tell the program just move it eight inches instead of 0.667 feet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to the options menu bar and select change units. And I'm going to change from feet to inches and then we'll go ahead and click OK. Now what we can see is as I'm moving my cursor now, all the coordinates down here in the status bar are being indicated in inches. Now if I want to move a member, I'm going to select my layout beam icon and then I'll ask the program to move a member for me and I can enter this value in inches. So I'm going to move it eight inches to the left. Go ahead and click move and I can move that member over to the left. Once I'm done working in the English unit system, I can go back to options, change units, and I can go right back to feet and continue working. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.